Please. Yeah, sure, sure. We we gonna do something different now. We okay. we can try like a romantic something romantic, no? Facciamo tutto l'amore che ho, okay? Well, this is my band playing uh, Riccardo Nori on guitar, uh, Leo Di Angilla on uh, very very low-fi percussion, uh, Saturnino on the bass and Franco Santarnecchi on uh, on the keyboards. Okay, Perfect. thank you yeah, for coming. Let's go. Le meraviglie in questa parte di universo sembrano nate per incorniciarti il volto. E se per caso dentro al caos ti avessi perso, avrei avvertito un forte senso di risolto, un grande vuoto che mi avrebbe spinto oltre, fino al confine estremo delle mie speranze. Ti avrei cercato come un cavaliere pazzo, avrei lottato contro il male e le sue istanze, i labirinti avrei percorso senza un filo, nutrendomi di ciò che il suono avrebbe offerto e a ogni confine nuovo io avrei chiesto asilo avrei rischiato la mia vita in mare aperto considerando che l'amore non ha prezzo sono disposto a tutto per averne un po' considerando che l'amore non ha prezzo lo pagherò offrendo tutto l'amore tutto l'amore che ho Cere infinito, mi sentirei se tu non fossi nel mio cuore, starei nascosto come molti dietro a un dito, a dar la vinta ai venditori di dolore, e ho visto cose riservate ai sognatori, ed ho bevuto il succo amaro del disprezzo, ed ho commesso tutti gli atti miei più impuri, considerando che l'amore non ha prezzo, considerando che Sono disposto a tutto per averne un po', considerando che l'amore non ha prezzo, lo pagherò offrendo tutto l'amore, tutto l'amore che ho. All the love that I got, senza di te sarebbe stato tutto vano, come una spada che trafficce un corpo morto. Senza l'amore sarei solo un ciarlatano, come una barca che non esce mai dal porto. Oh. Oh yeah. Considerando che l'amore non ha prezzo, sono disposto a tutto per averne un po'. Considerando che l'amore non ha prezzo, lo pagherò offrendo tutto l'amore. Tutto l'amore che ho, tutto l'amore che ho, che ho, tutto l'amore che ho, all the love that I got. Giovanotti live in the studios, KXP 90.3 FM. Tell me Thank what you. the song's about. The song is a love song. This is a, uh, a pure love song. It's about, uh, it's about love. It takes um, inspiration from the, the ancient lyrics uh, uh, of the Dolce Stil Novo, you know, the, the mi Middle Age, when the, the, the poets are uh, doing an ideal portrait of the, wi of the women, you mm -hmm. know. They were uh, trying to represent the women as, um, as an, 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 an ideal, you mm -hmm. know, a, a, as an ideal of beauty, of pureness, also of, of the creation of the world, you know, of, uh, th there's uh, something between uh, meat, uh, you know, sex and religion, you know, mm -hmm. some, something like that. Uh, and it was like, it's something like that, yeah. So you started at 14, so you were rapping about different things than you are singing about now. Tell me a little bit about the evolution of your style. How did you come from? Yo yo. I, to yeah, I come from DJing. Right I come from DJing. So uh, first time I, I never talked when I was a teenager to become like a, 
a, a recording artist. My idea was like more to do a DJ and to produce music as a dance uh, hip hop mm-hmm. producer. Uh, I was not supposed, you know, to 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 use my voice or to use my body. Then I, uh, the, the the real thing is that I didn't meet any kind of artist that uh, could fit this energy I, I had. So I started to do it myself, and I was playing beats on the on the, in the discotheques, in the clubs, and doing rap over it. And after that, a producer from Milan saw me uh, walking in a working in a club, and he asked me to 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 go to Milan to to work for his radio station. And he has also a, a, a TV program about videos. And so, like that, I started, and, and then I've, I've done my first album with uh, just a sampler, like an AK S900. I've nice. done like, yeah, very, very analog, you know. The, the first, the, uh, I really made the experience of the passing through from the analog culture to the, to the digital, you know. So, the first album was. Uh, total trying you know using records my idea was uh, reproducing the beastie boys energy Mm -hmm. in italy that that was the the idea i had also in the lyrics i was cutting and pasting you know the the, that kind of stuff in english and then little little by little i discovered that hip-hop is a sort of uh, black hole you know where a lot of materials are concentrated Mm -hmm. inside and so I, I fell in love with, with all music, from jazz to Italian traditional pop, popular music to opera to electronic, uh, everything. You know, my, my generation is a generation uh, that maybe don't, has, the, has the idea of uh, uh, cre- recreating sequences mm-hmm. using different materials. You know? And that's always been my style. Also, I like to write like a... a, a a traditional love song, and then I like to write a rock tune or, or a electronic. I think the the only things that connect everything is, uh, is a vision, a vision of reality, a vision of the world that is is mine. Perfect. I, I could definitely tell on the record that it's. Yeah. A in lot fact, of range. there's a lot of in America in the 90s there were people like. Uh, Beck mm-hmm. or Ben Harper, you know, that were experiencing the same kind of feeling through music, was uh, using different kind of material, mm-hmm. you know. And I'm trying to that. To, I've been trying to do this in Italy with also a lot of Italian, Mediterranean, and Latin material. Also. Okay, yeah. so you're tapping your culture. It's not yeah. really. It's not. And just I like also a lot of Latin Latin music, like Brazilian music or Mexican or yeah, yeah Cuban, all the Caribbean stuff. I like the, all this kind of stuff. Perfect. So you're you're going to be on East Coast tour. You're going to D.C., Philly, Boston, many more Italians there. Yeah. You're going to play in New York, which is going to be great. And you're playing the Austin City Limits Music Festival with the Chili Peppers, Florence and the Machine, Black Fantastic. Keys. That's going to be great. So yeah. you're going to... Uh, uh, Chili Peppers are playing before me, then, you know. They, they play... Okay. The, I am the headline. I didn't... Okay. <laughs> However, it's going to yeah, work out. But that's, that's okay. good. So they open. They are they are They're the opening, opening for you now. Yeah. And then I go. Bravo. Um... But that's going to be <laughs> exposure to a lot more people. Yeah, yeah well, it's, I like people. I like people. I like to play. This you is know? obvious. Yeah, yeah I, like, I like people. I like, staying, I, I like doing music. There's, this is something that I love. So uh, if, if there's somebody that know, don't know me, it's even better sometimes, you know? Give me this sense of uh, adventure that, uh, that I, really, I really like. And I have the age. I'm 45 now, so everything is more... When, when you are 20, you know... Mm-hmm. Um, it's different uh, when when you're t- when you're tw- 45 you you try to do it with a uh, you're more light about mm-hmm. that you know you're more light about it it's not a question of life and death and that that's you know? true it's true yeah. it's you, music you have less to prove yeah yeah mm-hmm. to myself first of all you know i, I have to uh, to do music you know if you like it uh, it's good and i try i, I do my best uh, to get in contact with you you know perfect 